A group of nurses are running Sunday's Cardiff Half Marathon in memory of a man from Afghanistan who they say was committed to helping patients with a heart condition like him. Hussein Amiri fled his homeland as a teenager and received specialist treatment at the University Hospital of Wales for almost 20 years. He died in July and the nurses running with his family want to create a lasting legacy. Nicholas Smith reports. 14 years ago, we met Hussein Amiri because he was making a difference to people's lives. He was a winner at the first ever Welsh Volunteer of the Year Awards. You enjoy it. Absolutely. You enjoy it absolutely. I like you meet to get the new people. I like learn lots of stuff. That day in 2004, his brother Hamid tells me was all the more poignant because it was just a few years after they'd escaped from Afghanistan with their parents. Countless and countless of countries that I do not know the names, uh, all illegally, and it was life and death uh, at times. And we had way too many close calls um, for anyone's liking. After several months, they made it and were given the right to remain in the UK. Hamid told me a significant factor was Hussein's complex heart condition. He needed specialist treatment that the NHS could provide. We knew we had people who actually cared about him and they wanted, they, you know, they wanted him to have the best life possible. The countless operations and medical support that followed allowed him to finish school and graduate from university. Sarah Finch and Bethan Shires are two of the cardiac nurses who treated Hussein. Full of beans, weren't they? A proper character. Yeah, full of banter. <laughs> what would he call us? Your Highness? Is yeah. that right? We'd pick up the phone if yeah. he rang us for any advice. He'd be like, Your Highness? <laughs> it's your favourite patient here. <laughs> yeah. Through everything, they told me he wanted to help patients just like him. He wanted to come back and be a, a support for other patients who were perhaps going through similar procedures or having a difficult time or um, were going forward for operations to support them. He also wanted to be involved with audit and improving services. So he was very committed in that sense. Hussein passed away on the 11th of July. To remember him, the staff are running the Cardiff Half Marathon this weekend. In his honour, we're going to raise money and provide uh, special equipment for the cardiology wards here. So things like TVs, camp beds for carers to stay, games, consoles, whatever we can do with the money just means that when people do come and stay, they've got a, you know, a bit more to do. It's not like, you know, the staff are brilliant. We do as much as we can for our patients, but just to be able to feel a little bit more at home in a you know, strange environment and to know that we're doing it for him is really, 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 you know, makes us feel good about it, so... And now, Hamid is writing a book about his brother's life. I think my ultimate goal is, is to share the story uh, and put a spotlight on my brother, you know, an individual who actually wanted to make a difference and done more than um, some people could do in the whole lifetime. What a great reason to run. Hamid Amiri ending that report.